She's asking a second question, but the sound wasn't very clear to me. But I think she was referring to dice. The hadith of the Prophet ﷺ is crystal clear. Why? This is something we don't know. The Prophet told us, Fajr is two rak'ah, Maghrib is three rak'ah. Why? We don't know. And the people are checking their dials and, and their headsets and their TV. What does this have to do with dice? Well, I'll, I'm coming to you. So when the Prophet prohibits dice, why? It's the same reason for having Fajr two rak'ahs and three rak'ahs for Maghrib, which is submission. The Prophet says as some, it's best for a person to dip his hand in the blood of swine, of pork, rather than to play with dice. That's it. Full stop. Does there, or is there any justification, any logic? This is submission. Why face the Kaaba and not put it on our right-hand side when we pray? This is submission. This is religion. You have to say, we adhere and we listen and we obey. So can we yani, sort of play around and beat around the bush and write uh, uh, numbers and figures on pieces of paper and randomly select them? So I'd have a piece or, of a card saying 6-4, as if I played with the dice and it says 6-4 or 6-6, six, six, which is the highest. So can I do this on a, a piece of paper? It's the same concept, and I believe that this is not permissible. 